Oh, that this too, too solid flesh would melt from Hamlet. Act One, Scene Two by William Shakespeare. This is a LibriVox recording. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. Recording by Caitlin Cooper. Oh, that this too, too solid flesh would melt, thaw, and resolve itself into a dew. Or that the everlasting had not fixed his cannon gainst self slaughter. Oh, God, God, how weary, stale, flat, and unprofitable seem to me all the uses of this world. Fie on it, ah, fie. Tis an unweeded garden that grows to seed. Things rank and gross in nature possess it merely. That it should come to this, but two months dead, nay, not so much, not to. So excellent a king that was to this Hyperion to a satyr. So loving to my mother that he might not but team the winds of heaven visit her face too roughly. Heaven and earth, must I remember? Why, she would hang on him as if increase of appetite had grown by what it fed on. And yet, within a month, let me not think on it. Frailty thy name is woman, a little month or ere those shoes were old with which she followed my poor father's body. Like Niobe, all tears, why she, even she! Oh, God, a beast that once discourse of reason would have mourned longer, married with my uncle, my father's brother, but no more like my father than I to Hercules, within a month, ere yet the salt of most unrighteous tears had left the flushing in her galled eyes. She married, Oh, most wicked speed, to post with such dexterity to ancestral sheets. It is not, nor cannot, come to good. But break my heart, for I must hold my tongue. End of Oh, that this too, too solid flesh should melt. From Hamlet, Act One, Scene Two. This recording is in the public domain.